So I, uh, so, uh, as I said, uh, the first uh, paper was, uh, was more or less uh, an entry point to Kett and uh, Friedrich. As I was working, he was always asking me, is, uh, uh, is uh, the entropy, is it a Casimir uh, function in this model, in the polysynthetic? That was always his question. So I had to, uh, to uh, spend a lot of my time, my spare time, because as I said, I'm a banker. So every time I try to, 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 to think very hard on that, and uh, yeah, for God's sake, uh, you know. Uh, at one point, I had some 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 uh, something about that, and that's why I I, I could have some result on that. So let us continue. Uh, so maybe here. Uh, okay. So maybe I'll, I'll I'll just continue from here. So. Uh, so, uh, uh, as I said, Frédéric and uh, uh, François Gay -Bal, uh, Balmas. So they, 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 uh, uh, they uh, uh, showed some 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 um, equivalence uh, 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 properties, which are uh, very general in in general frameworks. And uh, let me just tell you because I I, I will uh, use them. So, for example, that uh, in the polysamplectic case, and uh, there are two also there that, for example, omega is uh, uh, is invariant uh, uh, under the adjoint uh, 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 representation. Uh, psi also uh, uh, satisfies uh, this property, which is very important for me that uh, uh, the uh, the uh, heat. Uh, let me take that. The, the heat satisfies this property. The entropy also. I'm not touching the uh, fissure, which I think maybe I will have to deal with it in the future. But at the moment, let us uh, concentrate on other stuff. Okay. Uh, let me begin uh, with one of the results I uh, I uh, showed. So uh, uh, Friedrich uh, is, uh, has uh, showed, uh, or in many of his articles, he, he worked out and uh, uh, worked with this, with this equation from, from, uh, from uh, Soryu paper of 1974. So, uh, so I worked on that, so uh, you, you can, uh, so that was one of these equivariance uh, Properties, and uh, in our uh, in our uh, polysamplectic framework, that was our uh, entropy, and uh, why we 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 wanted to work with the uh, polysamplectic framework, as Friedrich said before, because we need to have these uh, higher order moments, and this means we 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 want to define this order uh, higher order heat. Uh, so beta uh, uh, j is now the entropy, um, the, the derivative of the entropy uh, with respect to the uh, to the heat or the j order heat, if you want. Um, so with with its help, we can define. <coughs> so uh, we 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 can consider the the, the curve. So we take a beta in our uh, uh, in our polysamplectic algebra. Let me tell the, uh, say that, and uh, this curve is uh, define uh, define uh, some some tangent vectors, and we can look how it behaves. So for that, I, I'm taking these derivatives, and when I take this derivative, I'm getting. <coughs> Here, this sum of uh, this uh, high order heat, if you want, applied to this uh, 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 to this uh, Lie bracket, and using this uh, uh, this uh, this equivalence, uh, uh, what we have before, 
and making some deflation at t equals zero, the most important thing we can, and using also the, the, um, the uh, properties of our Foo cycles, we can get one of the, uh, one of the, so we are getting this this polysymplectic uh, uh, the sort of equation which is equivalent to sino uh, to <laughs> the german coming so, uh, which is equivalent to the equation of, of Suryu in his standard model. model. So, this equation. So, in the standard model of Suryu, we have this equation. You can find it in many papers of uh, Frederick. And it's equivalent in the uh, uh, polysymplectic framework, it is this equation. So that is one of the results. So uh, as I said, this, this uh, paper is a summary of a paper in preparation, which is almost finished. Um, So, uh, and as I said, uh, the question was how how can we uh, how can we now uh, uh, prove that uh, that the entropy in the polysymplectic uh, 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 context is also um, uh, is also um, a Casimir? At, at the beginning, I. You know, because uh, Friedrich uh, was working on that area and also he was working with, with Francois Gérard. It's okay, I mean, uh, two brilliant uh, mathematicians, how can I find that? But then I was working on that and at one point I, I see that we can use uh, this extendedly uh, Poisson bracket. That was the idea I found out. Um, because you have it. So, uh, uh, um, and uh, that was, uh, yeah, I said, okay. Uh, so I, I, I did my calculations and after I sent to Frederick the paper, I said, okay, please look at it. Are you, do you agree with that? So I said, okay, yeah. So yeah, so that, that was the idea to, uh, I introduced this, uh, this, uh, this, uh, so we have here the, the, the normal bracket, and here you have the, the, the brackets, uh, or the, 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 uh, the, uh, the, the two cycle. And in fact, it is, uh, it is a Lee Poisson bracket only in the, uh, uh, in the uh, uh, poly uh, uh, symplectic case. And it has it, it satisfies all the properties of 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 a bracket, and here using what we we have seen before, you know this uh, uh, this equation of of uh, of uh, Jean-Marie Soriou in this in, in this uh, in this case, we can show that in fact using that that. Uh, we can uh, see that S, uh, 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 the entropy for every H is zero, and this means that uh, uh, the entropy is also can be characterized as a, as a, an invariant Casimir function in the coadjuvant representation in the polysymplectic context. And this means we can we can get the same uh, same properties as what uh, Frederick uh, 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 proved in many of his papers. Okay, um, the same. Uh, I mean, where we you have your 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 Lee Poisson bracket 
uh, I call it the extended uh, here, so you can use the whole machinery, you know, about the Hamiltonian. Uh, here, I'm, I'm saying that we have some, some multi-dimensional temporal, because you don't have only one, one, one T, you have, uh, so it's something, maybe someone knows that. I, I was working on that in the last weeks, so in the uh, multi cosamplectic area, you have also um, uh, you have also cases where you are talking about uh, multi-dimensional temporal variables. But uh, I don't know. It's something I'm still trying to understand. Um, so uh, yeah. But uh, as you see, uh, it's when we are using, when we are going to the standard model, it's, it's what we have in, the, in one variable. Uh, you have df uh, uh, through dt is equal to fh, but in the polysamplectic, you have the, uh, the variable di uh, di uh, uh, differentiated with respect to uh, k, uh, t, g, so. That are things uh, one has to think about them. So, yeah. Um, that is something else I just uh, worked out in the last weeks, uh, geometric definition of the heat uh, in polysamplic context, using the same uh, idea about the heat equation, you can write uh, this, uh, uh, polysamplectic heat equation, where, as I said, you, you, you are talking about the multi-dimensional temporal variable. Uh, I have tried to, um, uh, to, to find some, some uh, uh, what, uh, what equations can be satisfied by, by this uh, high order uh, heat. I found some, but there's still a little bit, uh, yeah, not so, I'm not so convinced, so I'm still trying to do my calculations. So I think, yeah, otherwise I have tried to also to, 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 to make some, some calculation about the dynamics with Casimir uh, dissipation and production. That is some, uh, yeah. <coughs> Uh, an application of what uh, Frederick said uh, uh, before about uh, how we can use the fact that the entropy is also a Casimir in, in the polysamplectic uh, uh, case, and it is also an adaptation of, uh, of uh, a calculation he did with, with, with Francois in your paper. So, um, where you, you try to, to, uh, to take uh, uh, the, the, S, uh, the entropy and you, you make a perturbation with this gamma and uh, gamma is, uh, is, uh, is, uh, is a bilinear, uh, is a bilinear uh, symmetric, form, then you can, in this case, are we done? Yeah. Oh, just, let me just, uh, uh, just to, 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 to make another um, two remarks. So there is a section in this paper about what we spoke about uh, by Professor Sabora about these transfers, uh, um, uh, transfers, uh, Huh? Yeah, transfer structures to Kojiman's orbit. So I have had, because uh, as Mr. Uh, Professor Sabourin has said, he didn't uh, look at the, uh, the normal cohomology uh, structures. So what I did in this, uh, in this paper, so I, I looked at the linear uh, transfer structures in the polysamplectic uh, uh, case. So 
I, I could have some, some results on that, so uh, that will be also part of this. So, yeah, thank you. Thank you very much for uh, the, this nice talk. <laughs> Are there questions or comments? Frédéric. Uh, the paper of Gunter, yeah. which is uh, Gunter, paper number one, part one, yeah. and he say I will write the, the following in another paper, and I have never no. found, no. No. The, no, okay, you, you didn't either. find the no. part two of the paper, no. okay, no. okay, perhaps the US have classified the part two. <laughs> Thank you. There are other questions or comments? Maybe I have one comment. Uh, which is okay um, on the relevance of the notion of a quadrant orbit. So why quadrant oh, why qu quadrant orbits? Mm -hmm. So why are they interesting? There are many there are many answers to that, right? You have answers in representation yeah. theory. You have answers in integrable systems. You have one answer, which is that they are symplectic leaves of linear Poisson structures. There are many answers to that, but one of very important answer, to my opinion, is this Costan theorem, which tells you that symplectic manifolds that are homogeneous mm -hmm. are quadrant orbits up to symplectic covering. Mm -hmm. So my question to you, and what is the pos what is a, a moment mapping? The moment mapping is a comparison between your system, symplectic system, and the homogeneous manifold. That is what well, is a, 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 a moment map, right? So my question is, what are homogeneous polysymplectic manifolds? Can you prove that they are indeed the guys that you are dealing with with your, with your framework of uh, polysymplectic um, moment mapping? To my, um, to my opinion, it's a very important question because uh, this is really what you do. You understand what I'm saying? Not really. So okay, so the question is, what are homogeneous polysymplectic spaces? Okay. No, we, we don't have time for the answer probably, but that's, to my opinion, it's a very important question because, okay, because of Costant theorem. Okay. Okay, but okay. Just, a, just a comment, just yeah, a yeah, comment. Yeah, but let us discuss uh, after. Sure, yeah, great. Uh, we were interested, I mean, okay, uh, great. that's why I'm here. <laughs> Thank you very much to, to be here. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you.